Hey, Stark Raving Realist here, Jason Stark. I'm I'm here in Adobe Photoshop, and I, and I'm and I'm I'm here today to give you a tutorial on how to make, um, how to make uh, the this 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 amazing image called um called polar plastic. A polar plastic um was created by me um as the figurehead for a campaign that my charity Stark Raving Realist is taking on. Um and that's to send me and my girlfriend Maud uh to to the Arctic uh, region to to save the floras and faunas there. Um and, uh, and and I've always been involved in in um in saving the wildlife. Um I live in Hawaii and um uh, and I, I, I didn't have the idea for for save uh, for for the for the my bear image um, based on Calvin Forsyth. Um, I had the idea to go to to the Arctic first, but I needed some mask or some figurehead. Um, and I happened to know about Calvin Forsyth because we both went to RISD, and um, well, he didn't graduate, I did, um, and. I found his image. Um, I, they, well, his images are ubiquitous. I can't remember whether this was before or after the the, the Yale show, but I, anyway, I found the image and I and I uploaded it to to Photoshop. Um, so you see the original image here. Um, now let me just show you my process. I mean, it was quite involved. I think in total it took me about three days to do all of this. Um, I, when I got the image, I was like, you know what? It's not it's not right. Um, but maybe I can work my Photoshop magic and make it right. Um, so what I did was well, I started by um, uh, transforming the object um, and flipping it horizontally. Ah, see, so much better. Uh, now he's facing the opposite way, and it worked. And it worked better under a woman's arm, because because I knew this was going to be a tote bag. So, and I tried a little prototype out, and it didn't work that way. So, so I flipped it. Uh, then, obviously, I needed to change the text because it was backwards. So I used the lasso tool, and I this isn't perfect, obviously, guys. Um, and then you copy, and you paste. And now I have a whole new image on a whole new layer. Okay, from there I went to free transform at this point, um, and I moved it backwards. Okay, fair enough. Now I didn't like how forced I did the font. Um, he didn't he didn't fill the space with the font, so I did. I made it perfect. Excuse me, I don't know why you math. I don't work there. Um, so I so I so I changed it there. Uh, then at that point, um, oh, I set that object, flatten the layer. Okay, uh, merge the visible. Okay, from here, um, I didn't like the coloring. Sorry, Calvin, didn't like the color. So I decided to change it uh, to this. So green, I chose green because um, you know it's a it's the it's the it's the symbol of the environment. It's the color of the environment. So I you color in, and so I did the same thing for all of the different colors, choosing my own color inspired by the Arctic region and nature and wildlife. Um, at that point, I knew I wanted to make some, some, some change to the font, and I wanted to bring in environmental justice. Um, and what, what's a better symbol for environmental justice than the recycle symbol? So I, I, I created this actually myself. Um, this, um, I, dra I, I actually drew that. I drew it in, um, in on a notepad and then I scanned it in and I, and I used Photo Illustrator actually and I cut it out and I brought it into Photoshop. Um, I also erased Forsyth's A here. Okay, and then I, I took a graphic from Microsoft Word, the comment bubble, um, and I brought it in here. I changed the color. I used a font from Photoshop, and I said, to really save me, stop using plastic. It's so inspired. Um, and, you know, it, it was just taking that image, of the Forsyth image, and it was building off of it. And, and it's an entirely different message. Um, and, and I think it's really like actualizing the, the sort of advocacy that he started. Um, and, and taking it to a whole new place. Um, anyway, that's the process. I hope you like it.
I hope you'll buy a bag, and I hope um, you'll see me in, um, in the Arctic region soon, freezing my tukas off. Okay, thanks.